Hi everyone, I am Muhammad Yasin from the Department of Management Studies at Central University of Kerala. Today I am here to tell you a book review about a book named The Story of My Life. The Story of My Life is an inspirational autobiography written by Helen Adams Keller. Who is Helen Keller? Anybody knows? Helen Keller is a Helen Keller is an author, a lecturer, a political activist, and moreover, she is blind as well as she is dumb. She cannot see anything as well as she cannot hear anything. She has a different ability called deaf blindness. So the book is about 220 pages and 23 chapters. These 23 chapters are included in 53 pages. The rest of the pages are included her letters. Mm. The book is all about the struggles faced by the author from her birth to her teenage, teenage year. For, in addition to that, uh, Helen Keller earned a college degree in her life. She is the first human being in the world who earned a college degree who has deaf blindness. So the book starts in the year 1880 where she was born uh, when she has 18 months of old around one and a half years old she got severe fever severe illness which affected her to loss of her vision and loss of her uh, hearing ability also both condition uh, she met with uh, at that time her parents take to her to the doctor and the doctor cannot help her but the doctor recommends Dr. Alexander Graham Bell, famous scientist we all know. Uh, from there, uh, he who turns into uh, Dr. Alan Bones from Parkinson Institution. From there, Miss Sullivan sent to Miss Helen Keller's home as a personal tutor for this young girl. From uh, Miss Sullivan is an amazing personality came to uh, Helen Keller's life. Uh, by the arrival of uh, Miss Sullivan, uh, Helen Keller's uh, life changed from the darkness of the mind to the light of the world. From the darkness to the light, her life all full changed. Uh, from uh, Miss Sullivan, uh, she learns to love nature and education, particularly she learns uh, how to read. And from that stage, it is a very giftful moment because she is very isolated and trapped in her. But Miss Sullivan helps her to improve her imaginations, everything. Uh, Miss Sullivan helps her to ima uh, improve. And both of them have adventures and adventurous type of trip where she can feel uh, all this adventurous but because she cannot see or hear. So uh, from that time, she improved a lot. She gained power which, which she cannot have before. So at that time she determined that ultimately, ultimately she said that she wants to study, she wants to educate. From that moment she educated and she goes to Ka Cam Cambridge uh, School of Young Ladies and she, where she can pursue the higher education at Radcliffe University. It's a very uh, big university. From uh, she worked hard and with the help of teachers, parents and friends with the help of them and by her hard work she get admission into Radcliffe University. From there she earned a college degree by her um, hard work and everything. She struggles a lot and from her uh, hard work she earns the college degree. It is very difficult for the blindness child to get uh, educated and pursue her education. Uh, by the conclusion, I want to say that he, she, she succeed. She achieved her dreams, and she it is, uh, and overcome her obstacles in her life. And she, the determination of her life gives this autobiography, this autobiography, the story of my life, an inspirational and stirring autobiography for all of us. This, this is all about this book review. Have a nice day. Thank you.